Well, as you know, guys, occasionally we have a chat um, with our friends at Steelfort, one of our, uh, well, commercial partners, friends, part of the platform family. They make a whole variety of gear that gets stif- stuff done in the garden, whether you're a contractor, whether you're a private person, you want a Cub Cadet ride on, on mower, all sorts of great gear. They do stuff with lithium vat batteries that wax your weeds, does your edges, um, and keeps things looking trim and tidy and proper. And occasionally we have a chat um, with, I guess, the patron, the old man, the steady hand on the tiller of um, Steelfort uh, from Palmerston North, John McAvinney, and he joins us on the line now. John, how are you, mate? Yeah, good morning, Sean. Not too sure whether I know you well enough to call you Shawnee or not. But Well, um... yeah, look, Banksy, I, can I tell you how far I go back with Banksy? <laughs> When I started work for Barry Soper well, in yes, I know, I know of him. September, October of 1984 at Parliament, mm. my first job at Parliament, John was the opposition law and order spokesperson. Right, and he was very way. good then and he would run around in the old days. We had tape recorders. He'd come in, Shawnee, I have a story for you. This is outrageous. <laughs> and he'd be great for a 10 or 15 second um, audio grab. And so that's where I met John Banks. Um, yeah, well, all those years. Oh, he can tell, he can call me Shawnee. He can get away with it, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah absolutely. Well, don't well, you go trying like it, John. Don't you try it. Hey? Don't you try it. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's he sounds like he's right on the button, and even at uh, I think he and I are of a similar vintage, and uh, he hasn't lost too much. He's no. uh, he knows exactly what's going on. It's good to hear somebody with a little bit of uh, backbone that. Uh, you know, hopefully uh, will emulate throughout the country. Yeah, yeah. Um, there's an awful lot going on. It's a great time to be in the business oh, we're think, in. We've got lots of listeners, well, lots of people listening to your ads, John, which is good. Yes, well, I'm very pleased to hear that. But, I, you know, from my point of view, I'm very pleased to see this change of government. And, um, and I just hope that uh, come November 3 that uh, there will be, a you know, a collective um, group of... Uh, leaders of the polit- political parties, you know, namely Peters and Seymour and Luxon that get together and, you know, don't uh, spar too much and, you know... As, as get on with the on, job, because that's what it's all yeah, about, John, isn't it? Get on with the job, yeah. It's like yeah, the people who use your gear, steel fork gear, you've got to get on with the job. It's got to be done. You pick the right tools and you get on yeah. with it. Now, you guys have had a, what, a website uh, revamp? Recently, yeah, we're, we've got a new Steel Fort website, uh, www.steelfort.co.nz. There's a new Lawnmaster website, um, and a new Cub Cadet website. So we've got them all up and going now. And uh, you know, we're really, I'm very, I, you know, um, I must admit, it's taken a while. Um, you know, we had only one, one website before, but we've got these three now, which cover all the products. We've got all the Lawnmaster generators, which uh, uh, we're now distributing. We've put over a thousand of those into the country. I must admit it was a bit, uh, um, you know, sorrowful to see a lot of them go over to the the Hawke's Bay. But you know, that's the that's what they're there for. You know, to help. Um, you know, the generators. Uh, yeah. You know, for the house power, food trucks, coffee carts, motorhomes, all those sort of things. So you know, having um, available power that you can take around the country. Um, is oh, I think they're a fantastic product. So yeah. uh, you know, we're very happy to be able to provide those. Yeah. Now, a lot of what people do, shopping and checking out products, I guess pre-checking out products is online, but I still reckon I like going to a place and seeing something in person, as it were, in the physical thing. You've got a showroom in Penrose in Auckland. Yeah, we have, 880 Great South Road. <clears throat> and it has all the... Um, all the Lawnmaster products, all the gen sets, all the battery, you know, lithium iron product, it's all on display there. And, we, you know, it's a, there is a facility there because we have a strong um, association with Miller in New Zealand, which we introduced, you know, 20, 20 odd Their years ago. Their kitchen wear, right? Yeah, with whiteware appliances, yeah. And, um, you know, and, and in my opinion, the best whiteware product available in the world. They're a fantastic company. And uh, so we operate what they call their outlet store. And we're doing exactly the same thing. So you can, in answer to your question, you can see that product all available at that, um, at that facility, 880 Great South Road. And we're just in the process of um, 
negotiating and, and putting a new facility up in Christchurch as well. Whoa. So we'll have the South Island covered as, as well. And the North Island covered. But in the meantime, you can go onto these new websites to check out what you want. If you want to go down and have a look at New York and Derry, you can go to Penrose. So you'll be able to go to Christchurch. That is fantastic yeah. stuff uh, going on. Yeah. John, they're no, obviously keeping clean. you busy. Do you feel as a business with a change of government, things might be a little bit more buoyant, a little more optimistic? Oh, absolutely. There was a, you know, I must admit, uh, you know, I don't think the ABs would have won under a Labor government, would they? <laughs> so I'm very, I'm very pleased to see that, um, uh, you know, this change of government. And uh, there is definitely an air of, uh, um, you know, belief that, oh, optimism, uh, we're yeah. We're going to turn the corner in this country, and mm. I, I definitely believe that. Um, I, it's a shame that it's just taken so long. To, you know, I can't quite understand how this hiatus has sort of developed in this country. We're well, you've got to count the votes. You, got, you can't just make them say, so, oh, that looks about that many votes. Um, yeah, yeah, but, but I mean, yeah. anyway, we haven't got long to go now. That's right, and we can watch rugby in the meantime is the fantastic thing. John, John, give me, yeah. a, give me a point spread for, for Saturday night uh, or for Sunday morning, mate. Um, I believe the ABs are so focused that they have a very, very good chance of winning this game. I don't think there's a lot between the teams, um, but I would suggest there is will be a bit like we were against um, um, who was it the um, uh, the Irish yeah. where we where the last ten minutes showed a lot of resolve in the ABs. I thought they, that was a fantastic result. But if you ask me to put a number on it, I think, uh, I think the ABs will win it, but I think it'll probably be, you know, five or under. A close run thing. John, always a yeah, pleasure uh, talking to you. Uh, we'll talk again soon. John McAvinney from Steelfort, um, bring you a wide uh, variety of power tools and products, particularly if you're in the contracting game, if you're taking care of Grounds, gardens, lawns and the like. Uh, absolutely fantastic stuff. Uh, visit uh, them at www.steelfort.co.nz for their full range of products.